Now that I have posted my response to my discussion assignment, I'm going to check back to see if other students have responded. I will click on Discussions on the left and find the assignment again. The assignment is Social Media and Personal Use. I will click on it. At the top, I see the prompt with directions from the teacher. As I scroll down, I can see many students' responses. To make it easier to follow, I am going to collapse the replies by clicking this button. The other button expands the replies again, like this. After I collapse the replies, it is easy to see that four students have replied to the teacher's prompt. One, two, three, four. I can click on each reply to see the student's response by clicking the blue arrow. When I am finished, I can click the blue arrow again. When I click on Preet's response, I can see that Jose has replied to her. She said, In my opinion, people will not write letters in the future because it is more convenient to use social media to write. For example, I can send a message to my friends on Facebook without a paper or a pencil. I can do it anywhere and my friends get my message instantly. It's much easier than writing a letter. Jose replied, I agree with your idea because I prefer sending messages on Facebook too. It is more convenient. Plus, I don't have to find a stamp and take the letter to a mailbox. I don't think anyone will take the time to do this anymore. Let's see what other students said. Juan said, in my experience, people will still send mail for important things because it is more personal and special. For example, when my friend got married, she mailed my invitation on very nice paper. I don't think people will use social media for wedding invitations, even in the future. No one has replied to Kwan yet. Jose said, I believe that people will only use social media to communicate in the future because young people use it for everything. For example, Teenagers use social media for all of their conversations with friends and family. They don't like face-to-face -face conversation. Mirette has replied to Jose. She said, I disagree with your idea because I know teenagers who still hang out with their friends all of the time. It's true that they use social media a lot too. However, they also like to spend time with each other, so I think they will do both in the future. They will have face-to-face -face conversations 
and use social media.